In the previous video we saw a very quick algorithm to find the inverse of a matrix. So if we have a 2x2 two two, uh, matrix with entries A, B, C, D, we saw this very quick and very handy algorithm to find the inverse. So the inverse of A will be 1 dividing the the determinant times and we you, you simply switch a and d so d jumps to the position of a a jumps to the position of d and b and c stays the same it just change the the minus sign okay okay so let let us do a couple of examples so if you want um, if matrix A is uh, given to you with entry 3, 5, 2, 3, what will the, the inverse be? It just exchange, right? Uh, well, first we take the determinant, right? So here the determinant of A would be 3 times 3, 9, minus 10, right? So that's minus 1, okay? So, this would be 1 dividing minus 1, but 1 dividing minus 1 is minus 1, okay? So, I hope there is no confusion here. So, okay, this is 1 dividing minus 1, okay? And what about the entries here? So, this will be... Um, uh, so, 3 and 3 exchange but in this case they stay the same right and 5 and 2 they stay the same but you have to change the sign here right okay now multiplied by minus 1 we will get minus 3 5 2 minus 3 with so many computations i hope i did not make any mistake Okay, let us do another example. I'm, I'm calling the same. Let me change this here. Otherwise, they will all be matrix A. So this will be matrix B. Okay, what will the inverse be? Try to use the same algorithm. Okay, 2 times 5, 10, minus 12, minus 2. Right, so we have 1 over 2, 1 over minus 2, of course. But I'm putting minus one half. So five and two they exchange, right? Three and four they stay the same, but we move the, the sign. Right? So now that will be minus one half times two, that will be minus one, right? This one will be three halves. This one will be 2, because minus minus is plus, 4 dividing 2 is 2, and minus 5 over 2. Okay?